Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl, AI the Great, and today I'm coming at you with another great video. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. My content is fragrances, fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. Now let's get started. Now let's be clear. I go by the name of Fat Joe. Shout out to my homegirl, AI the Great, and her whole family. One of the superior brands of fragrances is the Killian brand. I have a Killian barrel, costs like $10,000, big barrel of Killian. Very expensive fragrance, but it does the job all the time. Cool and drink. It's 2021, time to bring the light in. Y'all heard my brother Fat Joe, one of the superior brands in fragrances is the Killian brand and it's definitely one of my favorite fragrance brands but before we get into my collection if you guys have not seen my confidence boosting video with my brothers please check it out I'm gonna leave it in the description box down below now let's get on with the video so guys before we get into the collection I just wanted to show you a couple of items in my collection that's not a part of the fragrances and I want to start with the lipsticks so this is the case that it came in it's such a beautiful case, guys. You can use this as storage. So in here, I have six Killian lipsticks. I wanna hold it this way because this gold, it's like a mirror and it's gonna be reflecting on the light. But let me show you the color that I'm wearing today. So this is the lipstick that I'm wearing today. Another one of the Killian lipsticks that I'm always talking about, guys. I absolutely love them. If you hadn't heard the story, they purchased six Killian lipsticks for me as a part of my Valentine's Day gift and I am obsessed. They are incredible, guys. So the color that I'm wearing today is rose and it's a matte and the number is 260. It's such a beautiful color. It's like a natural kind of like nudie pink color. It's amazing. So, and they're scented with Love Don't Be Shy, one of my favorite scents from the House of Killian. So guys, don't sleep. I keep telling you, do not sleep on these lipsticks because I would walk into the Killian store and see these lipsticks and I would see them online and I'm just like, whatever, like stick to fragrances. But no, guys, the lipsticks are amazing. And they also have lingerie. Did any of you know that? They have lingerie. Killian has... um jewelry and they're all scented but anyway let's get into my collection really quickly i just wanted to show you the room spray this is the scent of what is this song of songs it's i love this bottle guys it's so cool you can unlock it and then it sprays out like that mm. smells so luxe i absolutely love this so song of songs guys now we're going to get into the fragrances i promise first fragrance of my clean collection is forbidden games guys this is a fruity sweet ultra sweet honey powdery fragrance it's so amazing so the notes are peach there's apple there's plum there's cinnamon bulgarian rose there's jasmine there's bourbon geranium there's honey vanilla and a papanox guys this is such a beautiful scent if you love a honey note mm, fruity spicy sweet honeyed fragrance guys this smells like candy like straight up this smells like a sweet hard candy and i absolutely love it the longevity it's not like super beast mode it's not gonna stay on your skin for hours but it smells so good guys that i don't mind here's the thing i love fragrances that have amazing performance we all do but sometimes i'll sacrifice the performance for a scent that's just delectable and delicious and just gonna make me feel all types of happy. Because that's what this is. This is a very happy, sweet, honeyed fragrance. And my only other fragrance that I've ever had with honey as a note was years and years ago, um, Marc Jacobs, uh, was it Dot Honey? I, for I forgot the name. But it was a Marc Jacobs fragrance. I'll leave, the, I'll leave the photo up. It was a Marc Jacobs fragrance. It came in a really beautiful bottle with like pink no not pink with yellow and white and black it was like a bumblebee so i knew i loved the honey note so when i saw this and i tested it out i was like oh my goodness like this is the elevated rich version of that mind you it smells nothing like that but i'm just saying because of the honey note 
like the honey note in this fragrance is very very prominent it's so sweet it's a beautiful spicy slightly spicy very fruity it's so good guys forbidden games by killian so our next fragrance is woman in gold guys this is a very classy a very feminine sophisticated rose citrus vanilla fragrance that is amazing i'm gonna keep saying that okay because i absolutely love all of these fragrances so the notes are bergamot there's mandarin orange there's aldehydes there's vanilla absolute there's rose there's geranium there's freesia there's vanilla there's akigala wood there's tonka bean and there's patchouli guys this is such a beautiful fragrance oh my goodness this is just a very classy confident woman she's feminine she's classy she's confident beautiful beautiful scent guys i absolutely love this woman in gold okay i had to switch up the colors there guys because i mean the two white bottles let me just switch it up a little bit and give you a little black bottle so this is one of my favorite fragrances from killian love don't be shy guys this is a very sweet cloyingly sweet marshmallow orange blossom rose vanilla amazing fragrance guys let me tell you some more of the notes there's pink pepper there's coriander there's neroli there's honeysuckle of course there's orange blossom there's bulgarian rose there's caramelized sugar there's vanilla there's white musk guys this fragrance right here is amazing rumored to be rihanna's signature scent i mean i don't know why every time i talk about this fragrance i have to mention that but i mean whatever i think you guys want to hear that if you haven't heard it before you're going to hear it here for the first time this is rumored to be rihanna's signature scent now guys this used to be one of my absolute favorite fragrances i do still love this fragrance and i never want to be without it but i've since smelled some orange blossom and marshmallow fragrances that have just knocked me off my feet but this is still a very beautiful fragrance. It's super sweet. And I'm so happy that I was able to get the black bottle one in 2019 is when this one was purchased because it's since been reformulated. And now the original love is in the white bottle. So it's not just the bottle that has changed. It has been reformulated as well as per one of the Killian reps. So I know a lot of you say that this isn't long lasting on you and you know the performance just isn't that great and that could be why because it has been reformulated but this is the original version and just so you know if you want to purchase the refill you know the little refills that comes in a little black bottles that is of the original which is this juice right here this really dark almost brown juice it's actually, it's actually like a cognac color juice of love don't be shy and it'll be available for the next six months so if you want the original in your refill maybe that'll perform better for you so you can always purchase the refill it's cheaper decant it put it in a you know one of the bottles from amazon or something like that and then you'll have your original love don't be shy that's going to perform well on you so love don't be shy one of my favorite fragrances by killian all right let's talk about angel share guys angel share i have said that this is one of the best releases of 2020 and i still stand by it guys this is a beautiful fragrance first of all the presentation is amazing the fragrance is amazing the performance is amazing let me tell you the notes so there's cognac it opens up with cognac then there's cinnamon there's tonka oak praline vanilla and sandalwood guys this is a very very long lasting fragrance it's super long lasting it projects people smell it it's compliment getting it's just a beautiful scent like i absolutely love it i'm so glad that killian has made this fragrance this is going to be a fall and a winter staple for me this is going to be a repurchase and a repurchase and a repurchase well i don't have to repurchase the bottle but i definitely repurchase refills because this is a refillable bottle amazing guys angel share by killian so now we have its counterpart roses on ice now guys this isn't a review because i have not worn this fragrance yet i mean i did wear it in the house but i want to wear it in the element of when i should be wearing it which is spring and summer this is definitely a fresh aquatic type of fragrance that should be worn for me in my opinion what i'm going to wear it in the heat you know when my body's warming up and i can see what it really does on my skin this is supposed to be like a gin based fragrance where angel share is the cognac i mean guys look how cute they are together they're so cute together and on your vanity or however you store them 
they're just like show pieces so there's cucumber juniper berries lime rose musk and sandalwood from what i can tell you of this fragrance from, from the experience that i have experienced with it i don't get a lot of rose this is straight up cucumber and lime on my skin maybe because my body chemistry hasn't really warmed up to it and i'm wearing it in the house well i've worn it in the house when i sampled it when i first got it it's a beautiful fragrance guys roses on ice by killian now we have this fruity floral white floral tuberose fragrance good girl gone bad i absolutely love this fragrance guys it's green it's fresh this can be date night. This can be date day. You know, this can be running errands if you wanted to. But this could also be you dressing up and getting cute and fly and stepping out. It's that type of fragrance, guys. The performance is amazing on me. I mean, not amazing. It's not like super stellar, but it's decent. I'm getting decent performance, decent longevity on this fragrance. And I absolutely love it. Good Girl Gone Bad by Killian. Now we have this sweet, tropical, coconutty fragrance moonlight in heaven i haven't worn this fragrance yet because this is part of my valentine's day gift as well from babe so i've only just sampled the fragrance in the house but guys it's so good it's so so good i can't wait to wear this either on vacation or as soon as the summer hits it's amazing let me tell you the notes there's grapefruit there's pink pepper there's lemon there's mango there's coconut there's rice rice vetiver and tonka bean guys it smells so good now the performance i can't speak to it because like i said i like to judge performance in the season that it should be worn like when i'm outside in the elements and i can actually get to tell you like what it really does on my skin in the house it gave me about three to four hours but i'm just saying i was probably too cold who knows you know maybe it'll perform better once my body heats up but it smells so good. If it doesn't give me more than three to four hours in the spring, summer, it's fine. I'll just take it with me or decant it because it smells amazing. Guys, mm, the aroma that's in this room right now is crazy. This is so beautiful. Moonlight in Heaven by Killian. Last but not least, we have Love Extreme. Guys, let me tell you about this fragrance right here. When I heard that Killian was coming out with Love Extreme because I'm so in love with the original Love, which is Love Don't Be Shy. I thought the Extreme version was going to be just that, Extreme. I thought it was gonna be Love Don't Be Shy, but taken up a notch. But instead it's taken down a notch. Not down in a bad way, but it's just not as sweet and thick and heavy and cloying like I like it. <laughs> That is why I love Love Don't Be Shy because it's a very sweet fragrance and I love sweet fragrances. Now they added a rose note in here and to me it actually freshens it up a little bit. You still smell the Love Don't Be Shy. You still smell the original Love Don't Be Shy but it's much fresher. So if you smelled Love Don't Be Shy and you felt like, whoo, no, this is too sweet for me. I'm going to get a cavity smell in this fragrance. This one may be the one for you because it's fresher, it's a little lighter, and it has the rose. So, and I do love it. It's a beautiful fragrance. But guys, it's not, don't think about it like a higher extreme version of Love Don't Be Shy. Like you're going to get extra sweetness and extra marshmallows. No, it's marshmallows and rose. But it's a really beautiful scent. It's sweet, it's powdery, it's fresh, spicy, and it's woody. And actually, the story behind um, Killian's perfumer, Khalees Becker, is so cool. She was in her, Killian was over at her house, and she, allegedly, this is the story that I've heard, Killian was over at her house, and she was cooking or making a dessert for her child, and it was like orange blossom or like orange scented water or something like that with marshmallow that she was mixing together. And Killian's like, oh, mm, that smells good. And they're like, he's like, can we make this into a fragrance? And the rest is love don't be shy history <laughs> but that's what i read guys don't quote me i have no idea so that's it guys my killian collection i absolutely love it killian is definitely one of my favorite niche fragrance houses and i want more 
I'm kind of leaning towards intoxicated. I don't know. Let me know, guys. Like, what do you think about intoxicated? Do you have intoxicated? How is that on you? Because I go back and forth. I have a few samples of it. And one day I'm like, mm, I'm definitely getting this. And the next day I'm like, mm, I don't like it. And for me, I like to be totally enthralled and in love with my fragrances. I hate when I go back and forth. I just want it to be love at first sniff all the time because that's the way that I know I'm actually gonna reach for it and wear it. Let me know some of your Killian fragrances that you have in your collection. Let's talk about it in the comments below like we always do. Remember to stay safe, be great, stay great, and always strive for greatness. AI the Great, signing out, but I'll see you in my next video. Peace.